guys, it's Nelly. Welcome back to my channel. I am very excited to start doing these types of videos. I asked you guys on my Instagram if you were interested in seeing weekly weight loss videos where I tell you guys what I have been doing that week, what I have been eating, how much weight I have lost in that particular week, and you guys said hell yeah. So here's the first one. I look like a 13 year old boy who's going through puberty. Can you see that? Um, I went to the beach yesterday and it's funny because people assume that because I live in Miami I go to the beach all the time, but that is not the case I go to the beach like once or twice a year if that but this summer I've actually been going to the beach a lot more and Point of the story is that yesterday I went to the beach and I have really sensitive skin and I don't think the sunscreen I used was great for my skin and I have a rash now can you see that I don't know if you can properly see it but I have a rash here and I have a rash right there but anyways that's not what this video is about today is Monday it's currently 12 30 I'm gonna go work out I have to do legs today and then hopefully when Lawrence gets home from work we can go ahead and do cardio for an hour this week I'm trying to incorporate cardio every single day for an hour so hopefully I can go ahead and do that today. Hopefully. And yeah, so I'm gonna go ahead and work out. I am drinking my Celsius drink. It gets me ready for my workout and I just love it and it's so cold and refreshing and it just, it just gets me in a good mood to work out, okay? So I'm gonna go ahead and do that. I'm gonna go work out, like I already said. It's kicking in, as you can tell. And then I'll catch you guys later. Oh my God. This is what BBG looks like. I am drenched in sweat. I can barely breathe. I just finished my, like there's sweat. Do you see that? That is literally sweat. I look so ugly. I can't believe, look at this. I can't believe I'm showing you guys the side of my life. I've always been very like, everything needs to be perfect. I need to always look good. And this is like very vulnerable video for me because I'm showing you guys like my struggles and like all that stuff. But anyways, I am so tired. I just finished my leg workout. Far I burned my watch, would show you guys. It's I've burned 320 calories just with this workout alone. That's not including any cardio. I will be doing cardio later on today. When Lawrence gets home, I need to do an hour of cardio. <sighs> I'm so tired. It is currently 1.30, so I'm going to finish cooling off a little bit, and then I'm gonna start cooking my lunch because it's time for lunch. I'll see you guys later. <laughs> Happy Tuesday, I'm sorry. I started this vlog today a little bit late. It's currently 1.20. I did a 35 minute cardio workout and then later on today I have another workout planned. Um, but yeah, that is pretty much everything that's going on today. It is pouring, it is pouring really bad. I was gonna go grocery shopping and show you guys that, but I can't, I can't do it by myself, especially if it's pouring, because I have to load the groceries into the car, then unload them into the house, and it is literally pouring. So, that's okay, if it stops raining, maybe I'll go later on today, if not, I'll go tomorrow, and I'm still gonna show you guys that. So, yeah, I'm gonna go home, eat some food, and I actually have to film. So, I'll check in with you guys a little bit. So I am in my kitchen. I just got back from grocery shopping. The shirt makes me look huge, but I just got back from grocery shopping. So I figured I would tell you guys, show you guys what I bought. I bought a uh, buffalo dressing. I love this in my salads and it's only 110 calories for two tablespoons, but for the most part, I only use one tablespoon. I actually had no idea this was really high on calories, so I probably won't buy it again, but I still really do like it with my salad. Alrighty, so I also bought some ketchup, and this is the reduced sugar ketchup. It only has five calories, and it only has one gram of sugar. It has one gram of carbs. This is actually really, really good, and I love it. You can't even taste the difference. I actually prefer the reduced sugar more than the other one. It's not as sweet. It's a little bit more bitter, which 
I like. Okay, so I got some smoked salmon. I love this to have with crackers and a little bit of cream cheese as a snack. Really yummy and really good. Alrighty, so I also got some brown rice. I really like this one because you just pop it into the microwave for 60 seconds and they are good to go. So I got two packs of these. They're really easy and really convenient. I also got some mustard. <laughs> so I got some ham and some cheese. Again, this is probably mostly for Lawrence because um, he likes to make himself sandwiches. My favorite wraps, these wraps are only 50 calories and they are so yummy. This is spinach and herbs. Got some salad, this is the one that I like. This is classic romaine and it has red cabbage, romaine lettuce and carrots. And I got some sharp cheddar, <laughs> sharp cheddar cheese. I like to keep different cheeses because on keto you can have cheese and there's tons of recipes that you can do that are cheese based so I have a couple of different cheeses. Next we have rice cakes and I like to get the ones that are lightly salted because I think it complements the peanut butter really well. I also use this as a snack. I usually have one rice cake with one tablespoon of peanut butter and that is my snack. Sorry if I look this way, it's just my camera is here or here, I don't know. I bought a little tripod and it's a little weird so kind of like looking all over the place but yeah, rice cakes. I love you. Got some more of the zucchini lentil pasta that I love. I love this stuff. So I got one of this. I got two of the cauliflower mash. Love this stuff. And I like it because you can season it with whatever you want. And it's only 50 calories per serving. So love, love, love the cauliflower mash. I'm also going to try these veggie tots. They're cauliflower like hash browns. I want to try this and see how I like it because I miss having hash browns and I actually saw this today and I'm like, hmm, I might like this. So I bought this and I'm also going to try the same pasta, the zucchini lentil, but alfredo with chicken. So I'll let you guys know how I like this, but it's 100% vegetable and it's zucchini and spinach. I also got some whole grain crackers. These are only 50 calories, 40 calories, I think. Yeah, 40 calories a serving. And these are really, really good to have with the salmon. So you get a cracker, put a little bit of cream cheese, put a little bit of the smoked salmon, and it's so good. So I got some of these. And I also got some thin, some thin bread. And last but certainly not least, I got the meats. Um, that is it for my grocery haul. I try to keep it as healthy as possible. I don't. I try not to buy any junk. I try not to buy anything that's going to tempt me into cheating, pretty much. So I keep it very clean, very vegetable based, and yeah. And of course, this wasn't like a full on grocery haul. Like we, I also buy like regular rice. Or I buy beans. Um, I buy more stuff for Lawrence, but he has all of his stuff. I just needed most of my stuff today, so. Yeah, that is pretty much it. I have to go film. It's 4 o'clock in the afternoon. I need to film. So I will see you guys later. It is Wednesday night. Today has been a crazy, crazy day to say the least. I haven't vlogged too much today. I actually haven't even worked out yet, which I'm going to right now. It is around 7.30, I believe, 7.30 at night. But I just wanted to come on here because I'm actually having a hard time um, today. Um, I don't know, but today I'm really craving sweets, like really, really, really bad. Sorry for the noise. Uh, Lawrence, my boyfriend, he is working on the boat outside and I also have the TV on in the living room so it might be a little loud but I just am having a really hard time today with sweets like my body is craving it so bad and I did have a fudge fudgesicle after dinner because um, I, I was actually really really low on calories today with what I ate and I could afford a fudge fudgesicle <laughs> and it just didn't satisfy my craving like I want something like chocolatey and sweet and like uh, Almost too sweet, you know, so um, 
yeah it's been a rough day when it comes to food I really want something sweet and the fact that I'm on my cycle doesn't help oh, I just want something sweet really bad and I also didn't have a good dinner I had eggs for dinner because I had a really busy day today so I didn't have eggs for breakfast I had them for dinner and it just didn't fulfill me you know like I want more food and I just wanted to check in sorry for the crappy quality I'm filming this on my iPhone but I just feel like talking to you guys might just keep me motivated to just not cheat and keep going I haven't weighed myself this week yet um I don't feel I don't know I keep asking everybody around me like I ask Lawrence like do you see me thinner I asked my mom my sister like do you guys see me, see me thinner and they say yeah but I just physically don't see it yet my clothes are not fitting uh, actually I don't have any clothes that fit me because when I started gaining weight I stopped buying clothes so um, the clothes that I have now they do fit me but I don't, I guess they do fit me a little bit loose, but not, like I was expecting more, you know? Or maybe it's just in my head, maybe it's just that I was so, I gained so much weight that the clothes was like really, really, really tight. So now that they're just fitting, fitting me a little bit loose, I don't see the big difference, you know? Cause I, I, I don't know, I just felt like last time when I was trying to lose weight, it was so much faster and I saw results so much faster. And I feel like I was expecting the same thing for this time around, but I also gained so much weight that it takes time. But I've been doing pretty good. I've been working out six times a week, um, and I've been eating good. I have incorporated carbs into my diet just to give me energy to work out, but I might start cutting back on the carbs. I mean, the carbs that I'm having in a day, they don't exceed more than 40 grams. But maybe I could bring it down to like 25, 30 grams of carbs. Um, like today for lunch, because I was out, I had to have brown rice. Um, that was the healthiest thing that I could find. So I found some brown rice with chicken and lettuce and a little bit of Caesar dressing. So I think I had too much carbs today. Um, but yeah, I don't know what I'm saying at this point. I think I'm rambling. Hello, you guys. Happy Thursday. <laughs> Forgot what day it was. I woke up with my eye like this. Bums me out because I don't have a video for tomorrow. I'm going to see if when I come back from running errands, I can come up. Mm, excuse me. I'm going to see when I come back from running errands, I can come up with some thing to film um because this is not cute and i don't want to put any makeup on my eye so i don't want to make it worse i think i'm pretty sure what happened was that i got lash glue in my bottom lash line like i've been doing so many makeup tutorials and this whole summer i beat my face up like every single day just trying to upload a lot and um i feel like i put too much lash glue on the top oh you know what i can maybe cover it with these glasses now that i think about it <laughs> maybe not um so i have been putting too much lash glue on the top and i specifically remember that this past monday i believe some lash glue got in my lower lash line and i pulled it and i think that when i pulled it i may have caused some irritation in the hair follicle oh you can see a chicken my neighborhood is full of chickens <laughs> i think that i may have um like pulled a lash so i have my eye is pretty swollen um i'm gonna go see if i buy um i do see it has like a little pimple um but yeah, I'm going to see if I buy some drops and see if we can get at least, and it hurts, it hurts a lot. Yeah, I bought a little tripod for my car. I hope, I hope it stays. Alrighty, so anyways, I am on the way to run some errands. And then I also, I'm sorry if it's shaky, you guys, I'm in the car. Oh, <laughs> oh boy. 
So I just finished my full body workout. I am exhausted, but I'm feeling good. I feel like today after I've been having a rough couple of days with eating, I've been craving sweets really, really bad. But um, today I feel good. Today I feel motivated again. Today I feel like I'm seeing progress. Um, I feel good. I feel really, really good and I'm just excited to to start to see results. I haven't weighed myself yet. I'm probably gonna weigh myself tomorrow on Saturday. But yeah, I also wanted to let you guys know that I did upload a what I eat in a day. So I'll have that linked up here in the cards or is it here? I don't know which side, but I'm tired. My arms feel like noodles. Definitely sweaty and my eye is looking a little better. It's not that swollen anymore. Alrighty, I'm gonna go shower and relax. I, my arm hurts, I can't hold my phone. Okay, bye. Okay, so it is still Friday. It is currently 7.30, but I've talked about briefly how I have been having a little bit of a bad sweet tooth this week and I've been really struggling with it. And I was actually talking to my sister and she told me that I should try chickpea cookies. And I have never heard of them, I have never tried them, but I look at the recipe and surprisingly enough, I had most of the ingredients. So I went really quick to my local grocery store and I picked up the rest of what I needed. So I thought we would do them together and see how it works out. So let's do it alrighty so this is everything that the recipe says you need not this this was for dinner that's cheese okay so you need honey you need vanilla extract you need natural peanut butter that the only ingredients are salt and peanuts it can't have any oil it has to be very low in ingredients you need baking powder you need a can of chickpeas and you need some semi-sweet chocolate chip. I don't really know the exact measurement. I have to look at the recipe, but I'll leave everything in the description so that you can go ahead and uh, check it out. So I'm gonna put everything together and blend it and let's see how it tastes. <laughs> Okay, so the cookies are out of the oven and um, they look nothing like the picture. They look a little burnt, but I don't know. I don't know. So I'm gonna let them cool for a little bit and then we'll do a little taste test. Okay, so I'm sitting down and I have a cookie in front of me and we're gonna go ahead and try it. They look so ugly. Like, it does not look appealing. Mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Oh, yeah. This is good. Wow, this is so good. This definitely hit the spot of what I wanted to eat. Like, this tastes really, really good. Hello you guys, check out my wig. <laughs> it is currently Sunday, it is 12 in the afternoon and I'm editing my vlog to upload it and I realized that I never ended my vlog. So I am here to end the vlog. I did not weigh myself this weekend. I am just so scared of that damn scale, but I will weigh myself this upcoming Wednesday for sure. I'm gonna go buy a scale and we're gonna weigh ourselves together. I just want to thank you guys so much for tuning in and I hope you guys found this video somewhat entertaining and see my struggles and I hope you learn from my struggles and you learn from myself, I guess. I will see you guys again next Sunday with another vlog and hopefully we have some good news next week that I've lost some weight and yeah, because this week I've just been not, I've just, I don't know, I just haven't been feeling great and I feel like I don't, I'm not seeing changes physically yet, like a lot, so 
It's been a weird week, but that's okay because we're gonna get a fresh new start tomorrow and we're gonna start this thing again and we're gonna keep going. So thank you so much for watching. I love you guys so much. Thank you for keeping me motivated. Thank you for being so understanding and loving and I appreciate you guys so much. So yeah, please don't forget to subscribe. Give the video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed and share the video with your family and your friends and your loved ones. So I love you and I will see you guys. I'll see you guys tomorrow with a new video, but then I will see you guys on Sunday with another weight loss vlog. Mwah.